This video will serve as an introduction to LINK. Language Integrated Query, or LINK, extends the querying capability of Visual Basic. LINK has a different, though similar, syntax to SQL. LINK to SQL classes are mapped to database tables and are called Entity Classes. Let's go to File New Project, Visual Basic Windows Form Application, choose your name, your location, your solution name, and choose OK. Let's add a new item to our application. I'm going to use the Solution Explorer. Right click on my application. Go to Add. New Item. And I'm looking for Link to SQL Classes. Change the name and choose Add. It will appear in your Solution Explorer as a .dbml file. The DBML file uses the OR designer, the Object Relational Di Designer. We're going to use the Server Explorer for our connection to the database. If your Server Explorer is not showing, click on View, Server or Explorer, or use the shortcut key combination of Control-Alt-S. You can use your existing data connection or add a new connection. I am using the Karate database, and I'm interested in the instructor's table this time. I'm going to click and drag the instructor's table to my OR designer. It gives me a graphical view of my instructor's table and my fields, which it calls properties, the ID field and the last name field. I'm going to return to my form now. And from my toolbox, from my data collection, I'm going to add a data grid view. And on my form load event, I'm going to add some code. I'm going to create a new data context, naming it DB, and I'm going to create a new query from my instructor's table, you can see that the query syntax is very SQL-like. And I'm going to create the data source from my data grid view equal to the query. And let's run this. Notice the order of my instructors is in alphabetical order. Now let's go back and change this. This time I'm going to order it in descending order. And let's run it again. So this video has been a quick introduction to Link. 